An Arsenal employee is trying to make a difference to prevent suicide. As a suicide survivor, he wants to let people know that it does get better. Family issues and a marriage that ended in divorce drove Terry Neal into a deep depression. But after a few days in the hospital, he had a change of heart. Now he's looking to help others. Local 4's Yukari Nakayama reports. A traumatic incident shook Terry Neal and his family to the core. Did he make it? Terry tried to take his own life back in 2006. After a failed marriage, his family tried to help, but Terry had other plans. When we first saw him, he just didn't know he was going to make it or not. And the first night, the hospital emergency room and ICU, and you know, after the surgery and everything, it just, your whole life's gone. His recovery wasn't easy. I had to basically learn to talk again because I had one working vocal cord. Um, well, the body's pretty magical because my left vocal cord is still paralyzed. Terry was determined to get better. I wanted a clear, clear mind because um, I, I really needed to know how my mind was functioning and how it was going to work when I was building that foundation. And a part of that foundation started at his family's farm where he says he feels more at peace. To me, that is, it's home. It will always be home. Um, it, if When things are rough or I'm not having a good day, I can always go over to the farm. He encourages others that when they're feeling down to find a sacred place and to keep the conversation going. If anything, I want you to talk to someone, smile to someone, um, help them get to another. If you've got a friend that's down, listen to them. In Rock Island, Yukari Nakayama, Local 4 News.